you get out on the slopes first thing in the morning and you're greeted by this. Nice, beautiful, fresh corduroy. You think the snow fairy comes in overnight and lays this down? Think again. To get a better idea of how the slopes get these conditions, I hopped on the back of a sled where I was taken up to a trail that was just being groomed. I'm gonna let you jump right in with them. All right. We're gonna go from there and we'll take you right up to Blackout, push the big whales. You guys nice. see what we're doing there. Too. That's good. Right. Thanks. From there, it was into the cat where first shift supervisor Art, 27 year veteran, gave me the lowdown on things. This is called a print-off groomer. It's um, originally made by Bombardier, but it's um, 500 horsepower, and um, it's one of the biggest grooming machines made. It has a 22-foot blade on it. With these giant blades, they scoop snow into their path and groom it out with the tiller. Power tiller is 24 foot on the back. It's just an incredible machine. You got very good blade functions, tiller functions. It's just a great machine. It'll climb just about all the trails we have here. That's heading up trails that are 45 degrees or steeper. And that is how you get it all the way up to the trees. Yeah. <laughs> it's a snow cat convoy. If we're out here because being out late in the morning or something, yeah. you have to have an escort off. It takes a lot of ski patrollers and everybody to get us out of here, oh, back man. to the shop. <laughs> when we arrived at Blackout, Art showed me how to flatten out the large mounds of snow known as whales. Once the whales get flattened out, the trails get power tilled and set for skiing. So hey, the next time you're out on that trail enjoying that fresh corduroy, take a minute, give a little thought to those who made it all possible. <laughs>